seven chord, so G, B, D, and F. If you play those notes in any order, any of the instrument, you'll be playing a G7 or G dominant seven chord. So let's listen to what that sounds like. So G, B, D, F, dominant seven. And you might be able to hear that um, the dominant seven chord has a sort of sound to it as well, just the way the same way a major seven chord has a sound. For instance, this was our C dominant seven chord. Right? Dominant seven. Okay. Then here's our G dominant seven chord. Dominant seven. Okay. So. Da, 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 da. And actually, a really good exercise is to practice singing these different notes in these types of chords because it's good to sort of have an understanding of just the sound of, a, of all these different types of chords in your head. What I like to sing for major seven chords is. This is a major seven, right? And then I, I'll go, this is a dominant seven, okay? This is a major seven, this is a dominant seven. So good things to practice singing, uh, starting on every single note, not just those two, but for the sake of this video, we're just doing only a few root note examples. Okay, we'll do one more dominant seven chord. Let's do 